What's going on, my beautiful Geminis? What's going on in the love realm? Thank you so much for letting me enter into your space. This is Amore e Bella Tarot. Thank you so very much. I'm truly blessed to, to be with y'all today. This is a message for your love area for all my beautiful Geminis. What's going on, my beautiful Geminis? Happy birthday to you all. Thank you, Father Almighty. Amen. All right, we're going to receive three different cards from the Keeper deck. Um, what do we have for my Geminis? What's going on with Geminis? We will receive three messages, and then we will clarify with the tarot. I hope everybody's doing well. We've overcome such a traumatic uh, thing in our lives, so we are truly blessed to be here today. Okay, okay, just saying. Okay. And your first message, let's get the party started, my beautiful Geminis. What's going on with my Geminis? With the Keeper deck, what's going on with Geminis? <laughs> Every Gemini in the world is getting married. So Gemini, you are, um, your relationship is moving to the next level. Definitely moving in with your partner. Um, you said, I love you. You love them. So there's definitely a new commitment your uh, relationship is going to evolve to the next level. And your second message, my beautiful uh, Gemini's, is, oh, you're moving. You're moving on up. You're moving to a new house, a new job, a new um, venture, a new venture. Yay, I like that. Maybe starting a new job. I see more like you're moving from one house. Let me see. You're moving from like... Um, you're going on vacation. Well, I see you moving chairs too. And you might be moving from a home to another better home. All right, my beautiful Geminis. Amen. And your third and final message from this is when you move to that new destination, you're going to leave somebody um, a little bit unhappy, a little bit. Um, um, there's trickery. Somebody's trying to be a trickery. So somebody's trying to fool you, Gemini, but I think you've already realized what it is that you want and the people that you're leaving behind are being felt like you left them out in the cold. All right, let's uh, clarify with the tarot, my beautiful Gemini. What's going on with all the Geminis all over the earth? Do uh, like, share, subscribe, guys. That is the um, fuel that keeps me motivated to bring you some free entertainment. And also let me know what part of the earth it is that you're receiving this message. And here on this wedding, somebody's getting married. What's going on, Hermit? You see clearly what you want, Gemini. You see clearly what you want. And the message is time, time spent in peaceful meditation and meaningful solitude. Shine your light as an example to others, Gemini. Seek out or become a spiritual mentor. Self-discovery. So you are definitely here to um, be the light for a lot of people, Gemini. You are here to um, help um, see that there's more to life than just money, okay? So you're here to be a mentor, to be a guide. Um, but you see clearly what you want in life. You see clearly who it is, this person that brings you happiness and joy that you want a serious commitment with. And here you have the Empress. So you're moving in with the love of your life. Gemini, you're definitely moving in with somebody who is uh, nurturing, loving, uh, loves earth, loves everybody. So somebody who is very loving, nurturing, somebody who's very abundant in all spiritual realms, which is spiritually or love. Um, it says take time, time to take action, Gemini. Give birth to your dreams. Creative projects will be very successful. Abundance and prosperity to all my gorgeous Geminis. That deserves a little ring, 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 ring. So you're definitely moving into maybe a new job that's going to bring you a lot of starting your own business here, Gemini. But you're definitely moving towards something that is very much that fulfills you and brings you a lot of happiness. And here with these people left behind, what's going on? Why is this card here? the emperor you're leaving your ego behind my beautiful um gemini so you see clearly what you want you're speaking your truth you're moving forth uh, the emperor oh shit shit look at that look at that hail to the yeah you got the emperor and the empress is coming up back to back out of 78 cards my beautiful gemini's that's that's a 
romance of a lifetime, my beautiful Gemini's. You see clearly you're moving towards this. Oh, shit. Okay, look at that, Gemini. A love of a lifetime. You see clearly that you deserve the emperor, the empresses. Power couple, my friends. Power couple, my beautiful Gemini's. You're finally marrying the person that is made for you, your soul partner. You have a soul contract, my beautiful Gemini's. You know each other from a different life and you're coming together. What a blessing, my beautiful, uh, beautiful Gemini's. And we're gonna get some of this other deck right here to clarify. Let's clarify what's going on with all the Gemini's all over the earth. Angels, guys, what do we have for my beautiful Gemini? Why is this a marriage, this commitment, this partnership that is coming to all my beautiful Gemini? There's a lot of uh, uh, detoxing of uh, bad energies and clarifying your your life in, 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 in a happier way, all right? Why is this hermit here? You have the eight of wands. You're definitely going to communicate your love to somebody, Gemini, or somebody's going to come and communicate to you their feelings of love that they have for you. So there's definitely going to be communication in, in, in the emotional, in your partnership, okay? A lot of communication. I hear this car with the, the movement. Where is my beautiful Gemini's going? Where are my beautiful Gemini's going? And they're moving towards something that attracts you, something that is magnetic to you, my beautiful Gemini. Something that is very, very attracting. Something that is almost, you can't be without, my beautiful Gemini's, all right? So that's your empress. That's your emperor. You're moving on up to that partnership that, fulfills you 100%. And here you're living behind these toxic people. What's going on with these toxic people? The king of swords. Definitely your, your, um, that's your card, Gemini. So you're definitely, um, Stepping into your truth, my beautiful Gemini's. You're stepping into your truth. You're making all the right decisions. You're leaving everything that is no longer making you happy. No, Whatever is not truthful, my beautiful uh, Gemini's, you're cutting it right out of your life. And you're moving forth towards your happy place, towards your power couple. Amen. That is beautiful, Gemini. All right. Now let's move on to the... To the... um messages what do we have for my beautiful gemini's for june in love what's going on with my beautiful gemini's with this power couple all this communication all this you're finally going towards what really makes you happy something that is kind of so magnetically attracting you my beautiful gemini's and look at how beautiful that card is and your message my beautiful gemini's is as the season of life turn, remember your life and all your experiences are driven by the invisible wheels of love. Life is an eternal ocean and death and rebirth are the rising and falling of the same wave. Attached to every ending is a new beginning. So you are definitely purging everything that is no longer um we all evolve, uh, Gemini. We all transition to become different, different people because we come across different circumstances. So you are transformed to that beautiful being that that you are starting something beautiful. You're ending something, but it's something that is <laughs> is so worth it. It's so magical, my beautiful Gemini's. God is good. God is good. All right, let's keep on. Going with the messages. What's going on with my beautiful Gemini's in love for June? Middle of June. What's going on with my Gemini's? Happy birthday. Birthday, birthday. All right. What's going on with all my beautiful Gemini's? What's going on? We'll pick that one. In love. And your message from the romance angel is heart to heart conversations. Heart to heart conversation. It is time for you to express your love, to conversate, honestly discuss your feelings with one another. So there's definitely a lot of feelings you have. You have this person that has magically attracted you. 
um, my beautiful Gemini's. All right. All right. Let's continue with the messages. What's going on with my Gemini's? What do our angels want to tell our beautiful Gemini's for June? I love what's going on. Okay. And your message, Gemini, your message is forgiveness, forgiveness, especially ourselves, Gemini. We need to forgive ourselves. Sometimes we're too hard on ourselves. And here it says, holding on to resentment and anger is preventing or even suffocating your spiritual growth. Resentment is one of the strongest and most damaging of human emotions. The act of forgiveness in its own own right is equally incredibly powerful and it has the capacity to heal and transform so love yourself gemini you deserve this power couple you deserve love you deserve you deserve to be loved okay so we need to forgive others and forgive ourselves and especially forgive for, forgive Forgive and forget the past, my beautiful Gemini's, because you you are the badass person that you are today. Thanks to all those people that, all those lessons that were not easy that you learned, right? And now we're going to seal the deal here on this love spread for my beautiful Gemini's, that power couple. What does your person in mind want to verbalize to you right now, my beautiful Gemini's? What does your person in mind want to verbalize to you at this very moment? And your person in mind, Gemini, wants to say, you are an angel. You are an angel. They do love you. They do want you. You are an angel to them. You have transformed their life. That is your message, my beautiful Geminis. God bless. Until next time.